Dr. D. Luke? Oh, I was just wondering who'd be coming all the way out here during the Vine Laser Fest. So, it's you two. <sighs> and you too. Brr, so cold. Almost enough to make me feel unwelcome here, Master D. Luke. Don't forget that this is my home too. I'm fairly certain that taking a trip home during festival season is a universal custom, common to all the cultures of Tevat. Please get to the point. The point is one that you've already raised yourself. The Vinlesa Fest. To celebrate this long-awaited festival, the Acting Grand Master has been coordinating with both the Church and the Adventurer's Guild to host a series of events. Unfortunately, given the financial situation of the Knights of Favonius, well, I'm sure you can imagine. And the Knights of Favonius's woes have what exactly to do with me? Hey, no need to be so cruel. Even I'm not going to take that. Everyone's just doing the best they can for Mondstadt. Now, I can't remember the last time I tasted Don Winery's Vinlesa Fest special. And I'm sure the Mondstadt populace would echo this sentiment. Are you going to deny others the opportunity to drink to their heart's content just because you don't like to drink yourself? Check it out! Kaya's not so subtly asking for freebies! He's actually doing it! Anyway, speaking of the knights, everyone dearly hopes that you'll rejoin our ranks again one day. Then we'll be one big happy family again. If we were able to enjoy the sterling reputation of Master D. Luke, my, I'm sure people would be queuing for our charity booth all the way to Falcon Coast. <sighs> Give that silver tongue of yours a rest. You might need it to maintain public order at the festival. Duly noted on the financial issues you raised. I'll have Elzer follow up with Hertha in more detail. And I just so happen to have a batch of wine that I can offer as a token of appreciation to everyone that has been working so hard for the festival. Shall I address it to you personally? That would be an absurd request, even for me. The words, with compliments from the Dawn Winery, ought never be preceded by, to the cavalry captain. Is that not the unwritten rule? You're better informed than I thought. In that case, I will leave this with Adeline and keep everything anonymous. I really can't thank you enough. Master d -Luke is so generous! That's all Paimon needs to get that warm, fuzzy feeling. <sighs> Which is just as well, since you won't be allowed to drink a drop. Huh. Are you two here regarding the Vine Laser Fest too? Poor Razor. He grew up so fast. And he's still looking for his father. Master Diluc, we really ought to lend him a hand. How come Klee said he's looking for his mom, but Kaya says he's looking for his dad? It might make more sense to them, but it's gonna get confusing for everyone else. It's okay. I understand. We have a spare barrel in the winery. It's a little old. But it's been specially treated for durability. You could leave it next to a flaming flower all day and there wouldn't be a scratch. I think that one should satisfy your needs. Sounds great! We'll take it! When can we come fetch it? No need. I'll have someone deliver it to the festival market. Just collect it from the Angel Share stand. Aww, you always make things so nice and easy for us, Master D. Luke! <laughs> a lot. Razor will really appreciate it. You're more than welcome. Helping each other is what friends do. Wonderful. Always eager to help and never forgets to return a favor. That's the Master D. Luke I know. Oh, it's nearly dinner time. Uh, would you care to stay for a meal? How time flies. I'll be on my way then. <laughs> How did you put it? Ah, uh, yes. Taking a trip home during festival season is a universal custom, common to all the cultures of Tevat. Now that even Master Diluc has made an offer, 
Are you quite sure you won't stay for a meal after coming all this way, Master Kaya? I couldn't possibly, Adeland. I wouldn't want to trouble you. Oh, don't say that. How often do I get a chance to indulge my dear Master Kaya, hmm? Tea for the cavalry captain when you visit in an official capacity doesn't count. I only get to spoil you if you let me cook for you. Oh, uh... Well then, what happened to your swagger? Lost for words? <laughs> Diluc, you... Surely you wouldn't dream of disappointing Adeland. All right then, I'll take you up on the offer. Adeland, one more set of cutlery, please, if you'd be so kind. Oh, Paimon's so full. Adeland's cooking's amazing. Everything looked and tasted so beautiful. Glad you liked it. You're welcome to join again anytime. Oh? Then I may have to tag along on the Traveler's Adventures more often in the future. Ugh, Kai is back to his usual ways. All right, now that our task is complete and our bellies are full, it's time for me to get back to work. Take care, Master Kaya. Have a safe trip back. We should get going as well. Liz is taking care of Razor, but the Violets of Fest can't do without us. See you next time, Master D. Luke. Indeed. Goodbye. <laughs>